example, we're going to learn how to create a frequency table as well as a bar chart and a pie chart. So I'll show you how easily you can click and create all three of them at one time. So first here we have a data set called drinks purchased. So you can click anywhere in your data set. Next, click on the insert tab. Click on recommended pivot tables. And here we get our pivot table fields. So here you will notice that the rows do display the different drinks purchased, but we're missing few things. We're missing the total sum in each category. So we're going to go ahead and drag drinks purchased and drop it on values. Okay, so here we have very easily created our frequency table. Now we can close this box right here and we can also rename our column header as drinks and frequency. Okay, next we're going to click on our table and again click on the insert tab click on the recommended chart section or we can just simply click on a column chart and select any design you wish. Okay, same thing, we're going to click back on our table again, then click on the insert tab, select a pie chart. Now we can also customize these two charts or we can just use a design from Excel. So I'm just going to click on the pie chart first and click on the design tab and select a design that I feel like. Same thing, we're going to click on the column chart, click on the design tab and select any design that we wish for. Next, we can go ahead and click on the title in each chart and rename them. Okay, so this is a very quick and easy way to create a frequency table, a column chart, and a pie chart using a data set.